If you want to create more engaging lessons and have the students do more hands-on activities, but you're finding it difficult to get that time in with your pacing guide, well, then the flipped classroom model is perfect to do just that. You see, I use the flipped classroom model and I love how it allows me to do more hands-on activities, more experiments, more fun in my classroom. For example, when I do the chemical reactions unit, now chemical reactions is one of my favorite units to do and one of my students' favorite units to do when we're doing our chemistry unit, right? I mean, what is more fun than mixing things together and seeing things bubble and steam and heat up, right? Turn color, it's exciting. So you'll probably wanna to do tons of labs, tons of experiments with the students. But with your pacing guide and having to actually teach what a chemical reaction is and the evidence is, you might not have as much time as you would wish. Well, with the flipped classroom model, you would get more time to do those activities. You see, what I do is I have them explore chemical reactions and we do just some basic ones, the, you know, the simple baking soda and vinegar. Uh, we might do some other ones. Uh, Gizmos has some great online investigations, lots for chemical reactions, and I might choose one or two for them to explore that way. Then they watch the video at home that tells them the actual evidences of a chemical reaction, the difference between a chemical reaction and a physical change. So they get all of that at home. And what does that mean? That means we free up even more time in the classroom to do more activities. Now, what I will say is that during this unit, you want to make a huge incentive for them to actually watch those videos. So what I do is when it's time for this unit, I give my students two days to watch the videos. And I always have. First day, if they get it done the first day, they get a special treat. They can choose between vinyl stickers or candy or pencils or erasers, something that makes them want to do it the first day. But the most important thing is to actually get it done on time. So if they don't do it the first day, I want them to at least do it the second day. And I make an incentive that really gets them wanting to do it. Because what happens is on that second day, when they come in and that flipped lesson should be done, for every student that has done the flipped lesson on time, they get to do the coolest experiment. That's right. I save the number one most exciting chemical reaction experiment for the day after a flipped lesson is due. And I make it so that only students who did the video on time are able to actually do it. Every student is responsible for the data collection and analyzing that data table and drawing conclusions to tell me in a CER format if a chemical reaction occurred and why. So they're all responsible for that but only those who did the flip lesson on time get to actually do the experiment. So it's a huge thing for them. And then what we can do is go right into even more experiments because I'm not taking up a day in the class to actually lecture and go over the evidences and compare and contrast physical versus chemical. We're getting right into the application part of it. We're doing those chemical reactions and it makes for a lot more fun in the science classroom. I'm having fun. They're having fun. Everything's exciting. So if you're doing chemical reactions and you want to do more experiments with your students, I highly recommend you check out the flipped classroom model that will allow you to take your lectures, take all your lessons, your presentations that the students have taken notes on, turn those into a video so they can watch that at home and that will free up more time in your classroom for more fun and engaging activities. Thank you for watching another Adventures in iSTEM and Beyond video. Don't forget to subscribe and turn on notifications for more Adventures in iSTEM and Beyond videos. For more ideas on how to incorporate science, technology, and skills for life into your classroom, go to Adventures in iSTEM.
www.thepeopleshow.com.